Reverend James Reynard from Yorkshire, England, with his wife and children, arrived Barkaville in 1868. Reynard was a frail man and was sent from England to Canada to regain his good health. When he arrived he found the town full of hotels, saloons, with the entertainment such as drink, gambling, and dancing girls. From 1868 to 1871, not only did he provide religious services to the gold miners, he provided music lessons as well. He started up a small brass band to add to the entertainment for the people of Barkaville. But times were tough as he and his family often faced starvation, isolation, and the bitterly cold winters of the North. His health deteriorated more and he was relocated to Nanaimo where he served as rector of St. Paul's Anglican Church. In 1871, Reynard met with the leaders of the community to discuss starting up a brass band as there was so much musical talent in the area. A public meeting was called to see how they could raise money to purchase the musical instruments for the new band. The response was overwhelming. Funds were donated and more musicians joined the band. With money in hand, the reverend sent away to England for the instruments. The instruments finally arrived in 1872, and the brass band started practicing six, even seven, nights a week. Their first performance, under the baton of Reverend Reynard, was on the Queen's birthday in May, 1873. In 1874, Reynard's health kept declining, and he took a leave of absence to go to Victoria. At the age of 45 Reverend James Reynard, the founder of the Nanaimo Concert Band, died in Victoria in 1875. During his leave of absence, the band was now under the leadership of one of the original band members, the lead cornet player and later the first mayor of Nanaimo, Mr. Mark Bate. In 